Buffalo. You had your opportunity and you screwed it up. You screwed it up. You could have signed Tevin Coleman, but you didn't. I don't know why. I don't know why. We've been talking about this guy since May. Did you just sign? What are you doing? I'm cutting a video for when they don't sign Tevin Coleman, Mario. <laughs> Do you really think that you're going to be able to get a player like Tevin Coleman in the seventh round of the draft? Because I can't say that I have the faith in your ability to scout offensive players that I'm willing to put my eggs in that basket. You could have gotten Tevin Coleman, and you didn't. What? Since May. So what's wrong with you? What's wrong with this organization? This is, you, the gift, wrap it up, put it on the doorstep. This was, this was an easy one. You got, you got two 31 year old running backs. Oh, Tevin Coleman's a free agent. Oh, Le'Veon Bell is a free agent. Oh, Tevin Coleman's not Le'Veon Bell. Perfect. Let's get Tevin Coleman. 26 years old. N Half limit, the carries. Limited. Same amount time. of touchdowns <clears throat> in the same amount of time as McCoy has been in Buffalo. Mm -hmm. They have the same amount of touchdowns. Mm -hmm. Why do we even do this? We have no way to listen. Deep breath in, deep breath out. Mm -hmm. I'm just so ah. frustrated. Yeah, How could you go through the free agent period and think that Tevin Coleman's not your guy? You didn't sign Le'Veon Bell either. Idiots. Wanna kick my dog while you're here? <laughs> <laughs> so to extol the virtues of Tevin Coleman, right? Mm -hmm. You can go back and watch the video in May. Yep. Go ahead and click that. Nothing's different than that. Nothing no. changed. <laughs> we got that video in May and it's, mm. nothing's any different. You caught yourself too, though. I'm proud of you. What? You almost cursed. Yeah, I did. I did. May! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is that a month? For me? Month. <laughs> <laughs> what have we learned here, Paul? We've learned that Buffalo is convinced that they can coach up anybody. That's what that's what this has taught us. They really believe they can coach up anybody at any position. Is that that's what I take away from this. You're not willing to spend the money at the running back position for whatever reason, I have no idea. They really must believe that they can coach up anybody. And I don't understand. Geriatric backfield. I don't get it. I don't get it. I, I don't understand. He was there. You can't be outbid there. for Coleman. He was, you, he you, was there. You can't be outbid for him. No. You've got enough resources. You, you cannot have be outbid for Tevin You Coleman. have a buffer of Le'Veon Bell. Yeah. That's what I mean. We're not, talking, we're not talking about the top guy in the market. We're talking about the second guy in the market. Who has more money than the Bills to spend? You couldn't get outbid. The Jets did. The Jets had more money. They're probably going to... They, 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 Bell, hello. Colts, they have Marlon Mack. Uh -huh. <clears throat> yeah, the Colts have, yeah. Um, who else? Browns, they took care of their running backs. Uh -huh. One's going to be suspended for four years. <laughs> and then there's you, Tevin Coleman. The buffer of Bell was the best thing that could have happened to you. Yeah, this is, this is best case scenario. Best case scenario. And he walked into the office, Brandon Bean walks in and says, you know what? I'm feeling good about our running back situation. No, you're not! How can you say that you feel good about this? How could you not get a guy who personally tore you up when you both were in Carolina? <laughs> I am so frustrated right now. I am so frustrated. You know what the most frustrating part about this is? We recorded this video on the 9th. <laughs> <laughs> we already we already know <laughs> and the lottery numbers are going to be yeah right boop, boop. <laughs> all right they'll um, blow in the playoffs they'll blow in the playoffs <laughs> they will they will they'll blow in the playoffs back the truck up <laughs> back it up turn this place into a parking lot <laughs> oh jesus christ